Hi, I'm Mohsin from SkillUp Online. In today's session, we will be learning about the data filtration by using Wearcross and discovering its amazing applications. Now let's move on to our problem statement. Our problem statement is write a query to face the details of employees working in a HR department guys. So here like all these are the details of employees and this is the department column and here inside the department column we have values like HR, admin, account and so on. So we wanted to find out only those employee details whose department is HR. Okay, so my first requirement is I wanted to get all the details means all the columns. So I will be writing select start from my table employee info. So by executing this query, I will be getting all the columns, all the details of the employees. But my second requirement is I want to see the details of only those employees who are working in HR department means wherever the department column having the value as HR, I want only those record. So what I will be doing here, I will be using the filtration method here. So to filter the data, we will be using the where cross where department is equal to HR. Means what I'm saying here, select all the columns from employee info table and give me only those records where the department is HR. So I will select this query and I will execute this. So here you can see we are getting only those employees in the output who are from the HR department. Understood guys? How you can filter the data by using a where clause? Okay, great. Okay, now let's move on to our problem statement. So the problem statement is write a query to face the details of employee having salary greater than or equals to 50,000. So same thing here, like we want to fetch all the columns, all the details of employee having salary greater than 50,000. So this is the salary column and here we have a salary greater than or equals to 50,000 like 80,000, 60,000, 50,000, 50. So same thing we are going to do here. We are going to write select star from employee info because I want to get all the details of employee, all the columns from this table in the output but the salary should be greater than or equals to 50,000. So again, I'm going to use the where clause here. I will be writing where salary column having value greater than and equals to 50,000. Now let's execute this query and see, are we getting the correct results? Yes, see here. We are getting only those employees who are earning the salary greater than or equals to 50,000. So let's uh, see our next problem statement. Write a query to face the details of employee who are either from Bangalore or Hyderabad. Okay, means I wanted to fetch only those employee details who are either working from Bangalore or either they are working from the Hyderabad. Means if any one of the condition is true, I wanted to get the output. Means if address is Hyderabad, then give me the output. And if address is Bangalore, then also give me the output. And what I want, I want all the details of employee. Okay, guys. So same thing I'm going to write here. Select star from employee info. Again, what I'm doing here, I'm filtering the data. So I will be using the where clause where address equals to Bangalore or either address equals to Hyderabad. Means if any one of the condition is true, means if address equals to Bangalore or either the address equals to Hyderabad, any one of the condition is true, I wanted to see those results in the output. So see, yeah, I'm getting uh, like the details of employees who are from Hyderabad and Bangalore. Okay, so guys, if you are confused between and and or, you can uh, like go with the another method. Select star from employee info where address instead of using the equals to you can use the in operator here so i will be using in where address in bangalore comma i will be writing 
Hyderabad. So wherever the address in Bangalore or address in Hyderabad, then give me the output. So if you are confused between AND and OR, then you can use this IN operator also. So see, we are getting the same results. Anyone any doubts till now? Okay, okay. So guys, uh, are you able to uh, like uh, understand the things uh, related to the SQL? Anyone any doubts? Okay, okay. Great, great. Okay, now here the thing is the another problem statement is we have to face the details of employee who are working as a HR and they should be from the Hyderabad. Means our requirement is the employee should be working in the HR department and that employee should be from Hyderabad. Means here what we want, we want both the conditions need to be true. Department should be HR as well as address should be Hyderabad. So instead of OR operator, here we are going to use the AND operator. So I will be writing select star from employee info where department is equal to HR and I want the address equals to Hyderabad. Means here I want both the conditions need to be true. Means the department should be HR as well as the address should be Hyderabad. So that's why I'm using the AND operator. So see here, uh, we are getting only those employee details who are from HR department and who are from Hyderabad. Thanks for joining us. If you want to dive deeper into our courses, head over to skillup.online or get in touch with us at reachers at the rate skillup.online.